War in Afghanistan, 2001-2018, Costs The cost of the war reportedly was a major factor as U.S. officials considered drawing down troops in 2011. A March 2011 Congressional Research Service report noted, 1. Following the Afghanistan surge announcement in 2009, Defense Department spending on Afghanistan increased by 50 percent, going from $4.4 billion to $6.7 billion a month. During that time, troop strength increased from 44,000 to 84,000, and was expected to be at 102,000 for fiscal year 2011. 2. The total cost from inception to the fiscal year 2011 was expected to be $468 billion. The estimate for the cost of deploying one U.S. soldier in Afghanistan is over U.S. dollar one million a year. According to Investment in Blood, a book by Frank Ledwidge, summations for the U.K. contribution to the war in Afghanistan came to £37 billion, $56.46 billion. Criticism of Costs In 2011, the Independent Commission on Wartime Contracting reported to Congress that, during the previous decade in Iraq and Afghanistan, the United States had lost between $31 and $60 billion to waste and fraud and that this amount may continue to increase. In the summer of 2013, preparing for a withdrawal the following year, the U.S. military destroyed over 77,000 metric tons of equipment and vehicles worth over $7 billion that could not be shipped back to the United States. Some was sold to Afghans as scrap metal. In 2013, the Special Inspector General for Afghanistan Reconstruction, a U.S. government oversight body, criticized the misuse or waste of hundreds of millions of dollars in U.S. aid, including the $772 million purchase of aircraft for the Afghan military especially since the Afghans lacked the capacity to operate and maintain them.